If you haven't already heard, Season 3 of Warzone is here in less than a week. I'm personally excited about this because I always love new content. So looking at the roadmap, we got a new gulag called Hold. You know, that should be interesting. We also have a new POI dig site. It's going to be between the ruins and the mines. And then we have new gameplay, which we'll see later. And the Caldera Iron Trials, which I always love Iron Trials. We'll see how it is on Caldera. Then we have Operation Monarch, which is the whole King Kong versus Godzilla type thing. We'll see. It's supposed to be just kind of an in-game event starting on May 11th. Not sure how long it'll last, but the season starts in April 27th. So it'll be a little bit after the season starts. And then we got tracer packs for King Kong, Godzilla, and the Mecha Godzilla, which is like the robot version. If you didn't see the last movie, he's in it. And then you can see here, we're going to get three new weapons, two right at launch, one in season. It's a melee weapon. And then we're going to get three new Mastercraft bundles and three new operators, which I don't really care about the operators and the Mastercrafts. And let's be honest, no one cares about multiplayer zombies, so let's move on. So scrolling through the content, you can see there's a new picture of the dig site, which it does say something about there being a lot of loot, so we'll see. It's also going to update the runway, peak, and lagoon areas, which I think is a great idea to kind of mix up, change up the map a little bit for season three. And you can see her peak looks amazing, in my opinion. I mean, just look at it. It looks awesome. Runway's got a few more buildings. It kind of took out that rock pile on the back and a few tents, which I don't think it's going to be that visited anyways, but oh well. And then for Lagoon, it just kind of talks about there's going to be a new sandbar kind of pathway to that lighthouse, which, again, is not that popular. Kind of talks about Operation Monarch, how there's going to be clues and stuff leading up to the big Godzilla and Kong event. Again, the new Gulag. We'll see how it goes. It looks like the first weapon we're going to get our hands on is the M1916 Marksman Rifle, which, let's be honest, is probably going to be ass because they all are right now. And after that, we got the Nikita AVT Assault Rifle, which talks about high fire rates, so maybe a little M13 vibes, but with a lot more recoil. We'll see. Probably going to be metal right out the gate like they always are, but I'll be interested to find out. And then we got a sludge hammer type thing for the mid-season melee, which, you know, again, no one really cares about. And that kind of sums it up. I'm excited about the new stuff, and I can't wait for the event on May 11th. Hopefully I see some of you there.